I is mid-April. It's actually the 13th. I did not fish the CBA today because I didn't feel like it was right to be on Chickamauga with all the MLF guys out there. I just feel like it's bad etiquette to, uh, you know, run around and really try to be selfish and catch the five biggest fish I can catch while these guys are fishing for 100 grand, you know, so not doing that. I am out here today. I couldn't stand it. Um, if I see one of them guys, I'm just leaving. You know, I'm not going to fish around them. I'm going to try to fish places that are not as good and just try to get lucky and catch a big one or something. I'm not going to bump elbows with the dudes at all. If I see somebody in a pocket, I'm going to just leave the pocket or something. So, might stop and watch someone of them fish for a while or something. But I really don't even want to fish with them being here. I might just see what they're all doing and, you know, hang out. I don't know yet. If I see a giant on bed or something with nobody around, because bed fishing is not really the, the tactic in this event. So, if I see one on bed, I might try to catch it. So we got one that I'm 100% about to catch, unless I got too close. I got super close because I'm going to put y'all on my head, and I'm going to try to make y'all see me catch this fish. I'm throwing a white bait. The fish is staying on the bed. The bed's super bright. Y'all should be able to get a really good vision of me catching this fish. It's going to be awesome. Okay, so you can see the bed is right there. There's a white spot. Hope y'all can hope I got y'all pointing the right direction. There's a white spot. There's a big white rock in the middle of the bed. And the fish is sitting right there fanning his tail right now. I'm gonna pitch my little craw right the fish's head. Hope you can see my white craw coming through the bed. I got the fish about six inches away. I'm hung on the end of that limb though. He does not like it right there. Looks like he's about a pound, pound and a half, pound three quarters maybe. You can see him turning in the bed. I'll try to get it right there in front of his face. I just bumped him with it. As you can see, he turned around, got back in the bed extremely quick. That's what you want. Ooh, he had it and I lost him. Mmm. How did I do that? I didn't really slack out, I slack lined him. That's not what you want to do on. You'd never really want to slack line a fish, no matter what. I hope y'all saw that, that was awesome. He was actually swimming around with one of these pinchers inside his mouth and he made a circle in the bed. That was freaking cool. There we go. You can see him, he's hooked in the mouth. It took me a while because I lost him at first. Probably a pound and a half or maybe, yeah, pound, pound eight, pound 10. Not a bad fish. Ate that dude right there. That's awesome. Hope y'all got some good view of that. That was cool. No hesitation on that one. He came right off his little bed first time and ate it up. Little white trick worm, little two pounder. That right there, my friends, is fun. It looked like a bill when I rode by, but I didn't see a fish on it. Pitch to it and dunk. A little bonus. He bit it like 12 times. Finally hooked him. It's fun, man, it's fun.
lost him a second ago. Got him that time. Little fish, but man, he's fun. it long enough to get him by the mouth he would not hold on to it I, he kept biting he kept biting it but he wouldn't hold on to it finally he did i saw a big one over there sunny like he turned up on his side wasn't that one and then i didn't have a saw him again but Took me a minute there. I'm gonna keep him so the female pulls up. Well, I did exactly what I wanted to do. I caught probably, I don't know, 10 off bed today. I, I didn't get a couple on camera, but got some pretty good ones on head cam. Saw some big females there like one day away. Like it's a matter of hours. They'll probably pull up tonight or tomorrow morning one. Uh, they were super close. I actually got one four four and a quarter to come up on the bed once and actually like nose down on my bait and then she left and wouldn't come back and she was spinning like 10 feet away so we're gonna take it back to the ramp now go home see miss hunter it's a fun day i love april i love catch like this caught a few on the trick worm rest up on bed all we need now is mix in some frog bites it'll be absolutely perfect <laughs>